The lock is too heavy, too old for this to work. Hmm, it doesn't fit. Hmm, it doesn't fit. Open sesame. Someone's been searching here. Either they didn't have time to clean up, or simply did not care. If father hid the key for me to find, then this means nobody has been able to enter this room since his death. Myths and Legends of the Highlands. From the library, I'd wager. This looks interesting. Hmm. Screwed down tight. <laughs> Someone didn't want it moved. Everything but the seal. Just bits and bobs.
father wouldn't have hidden his papers somewhere as obvious as a desk drawer. Whoever did this would have searched the room after they looked in the desk. Maybe they didn't find what they were looking for. Oh, some sort of secret compartment. father's handwriting. The chapel. The family chronicles. I may find answers there. Looks like a note about the cipher in the shelf. Looks like a note about the cipher in the shelf. A local girl goes missing. The concerns have been raised at the disappearance of Cora McKay, a 17-year-old local girl. According to the police, she was last seen leaving her place of work, the Three Kegs Inn, two days ago. She is the third person to disappear in the recent months, but the circumstances of each have been markedly different. Cora is described as being four foot ten, with grey eyes and long, dark hair, Anyone with information is urged to contact the constabulary. Why all the fuss? She is nothing but a peasant. A tavern girl. If you can't keep your blabbermouth shut, don't be surprised if others make sure you get what's coming to you. This sounds as if Grandfather Edward was willing to take drastic measures to enforce his will. What a mess. Letters about the day-to-day -day running of the estate. These might be useful if I decide to live here. The handwriting must be Edward's. Pay half what he asks. Forward to lawyers. Charming. And this one. Your money won't protect you forever. The hangman will catch up eventually. A curse on you and your family. Seems he was as popular as he was pleasant. I beg you to reconsider, Sir Edward. My family has lived on this land for many generations, and to be told we must leave our own home is too much to bear. Alice, my wife, whom you have met, is beside herself with grief. We have nowhere else to go. I beg you to look inside your heart and allow us to remain. Have them out by the end of the month. The signs are there. Deny them at your peril! The ancient evil that inhabits this land has seeped into the very stone of the castle walls. And if you do not tread carefully, it will infect your family! Contact the constable. Have this witch locked up so she does not bother us again.
House of Cerny has its secrets. It looks very precise, accurate. A lot of work went into this. There's a bit miss. Hold on. There. Stop your waiting. Stop your waiting. Wait! The boy! Did you see him? Where did he go? What did I tell you about disturbing me in my sleep? Huh? Are you all right, sir? What happened, da What happened, David? Uh, the boy. There was blood, and he he pushed him down. Who? Who do you think you saw? 